yesterday at this hour we were getting snow and today is kind of the aftermath of all that. It is, yeah. Uh, there's some blo snow blowing off the roof right now. You can see it out by the weather patio and uh, the wind is howling out of the west. Here's time lapse of this morning. We started with gray skies and flurries, but then quickly we began to see the sunshine. Unfortunately, even with the sunshine reemerging, temperatures are still falling and they've just recently leveled off in the mid teens. That's time lapse from Assisi Heights with our Lewis DeDotto camera here in Rochester. Uh, three inches here at the studio of snowfall yesterday, 2.3 at the airport. Now it's flurries and sunshine and raw winds as we're experiencing now. Totals across the area. Red Wing to the north, 5 inches. Austin had 3.3 inches at the waste treatment uh, plant there. 3 inches in Albert Lee. Tileman 2.6. Here in Rochester officially it was 2.3, but at the studio uh, northwest Rochester, 3 inches. Mason City, meanwhile, had 1 inch. Of course, the highest amounts were north. The light, lightest amounts were south. The rain was hanging out a bit longer. 20, uh, rather 16 in Rochester this hour. Austin now at 18. It's 18 in Mesa City and 19 in Charles City will likely move up just a couple of degrees. That's it. Sunshine having very little impact because the cold air is winning out right now. Howling out of the west, 31 miles per hour. The wind chill four below and the air pressure is still rising as high pressure draws closer to the area in the wake of yesterday's storm system. High pressure will be with us for tonight, diminishing the winds and then tomorrow breezy south wind as a warm front moves through, ushering in some warmer weather. So we have something to look forward to tomorrow. If you're tired of today's blustery walk, raw cold weather, it only has to be here for another day before you do see some measure of improvement. 16 in Rochester this hour, 12 in Fargo, south and west, Denver 25, Dodge City 38. We're not necessarily going to be quite that warm right away, but we may see numbers approaching 40 by Friday. Windy and cold uh, today, then is looking breezy and progressively warmer later this week. Very sparse snow chances in the coming days, so nothing new to shovel. Just what we already have that's blowing around right now. 19 this afternoon will drop to the teens. Briefly touching the single digits late tonight, and the temperatures will take off tomorrow, climbing up back, uh, back up the ladder. Wind chill levels around zero, if not colder than that, through the overnight hours. And at least by then, the winds will be a whole lot lighter after sunset. But future track today behind uh, yesterday's storm system, a couple of flurries and a few passing clouds at times today, uh, increasing sunshine otherwise. Skies will be clear to partly cloudy tonight, with a warm front moving through, generating just a few clouds first thing tomorrow morning, increasing sunshine, but also increasing south winds. Those gusts to 25 miles per hour, ushering that warmer air and temperatures tomorrow will be maybe just above the freezing mark. So it is going to be that much warmer tomorrow versus today. But heading into Friday, even warmer with a gusty breeze and a storm system from the west that will bring a chance of very sparse light snow showers or sprinkles Friday evening, but nothing measurable expected out of that. 30s tomorrow, 33 in Rochester, 36 in Cresco with the gusty breeze that later in the day reaches maybe 25, 28 miles per hour, not as windy as today. And the coming days uh, featuring a lot of variety, around 40 on Friday, but only 19 the day after on Saturday. That's the day of our toy drive. So uh, it's going to be cold, but thankfully sunny uh, as we move into the heart of the weekend. But today, 20 or close to it anyway, it'll feel like it's zero west winds at times 30 miles per hour. Tonight, the winds dropping to around maybe 10 miles per hour, a lot less windy, partly cloudy and a low of eight. And then tomorrow, 33, mostly sunny, breezy, not as cold. Uh, the wind chill only around 20, temperatures themselves around 33. And the seven day forecast, very light snow showers late Friday, then maybe late Monday. Nothing measurable expected at this point out of either of those systems, but very December light temperatures. Aside from that 40, that'll be kind of nice mm -hmm. on Friday. Yeah, that's giving a little variety to that outlook. A lot of variety, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Ted.